Dasha, come on. Arthritis and degenerative joint disease is one of the main problems we see in older animals. They come in so painful and uncomfortable. Although they don't whimper, they don't cry, they're still in a lot of pain. Hip dysplasia impacted Dasha so much that she could not climb stairs. She could not get into the car by herself. Oh, good girl. Running. She really couldn't run. Dasha's life has been, has been one of pain. Um, she, she has hip dysplasia and she has osteoarthritis and she's had to have daily pain medication and daily supplements uh, to try and manage her pain. My husband and I first found out about stem cell therapy um, when he was at the office. He w went on to USA Today and saw an article about Maggie, a German Shepherd, that had this procedure done. And I called our vet right away and said, you know, I'd really like you to look into this. I want you to do the procedure on Dasha. On Monday, uh, we had a surgical procedure where Dr. Bloom um, opened up um, an area right behind her scapula, right behind her shoulder blade and removed about three to four tablespoons of subcutaneous fat tissue. What they're doing is they're taking a part of her body and using it to help another part of the body that's not functioning properly. It will be priority overnight. Vet stem will get it Tuesday morning. Vet stem process it Tuesday morning. They ship it out FedEx Tuesday afternoon so that we get it FedEx Wednesday morning. Are you okay? Yeah, you look good. Yeah. And we'll be taking from the outside a needle and placing into this joint space right here a small volume of adult stem cells to decrease inflammation and to promote tissue healing in that joint. You're injecting the dog with its own cells, so you're not going to get any reactions from the injections. Um, and most of the time, they don't need to be on medications afterwards. Any joint in the body, they're using it for broken bones, for bones that are having a hard time healing. They're using it for liver disease in, in dogs. There are a lot of applications that this could be potentially used for down the road. She's semi-conscious, but very relaxed right now. Come here, sit down. Sit. This is where the incision was, and they had shaved all right here, and you can see how short her hair is, but it is growing back. Dasha can now get into the car by herself. She jumps right into the car. She's outside playing with Bravo, chases squirrels, Never did that. Get the squirrel! Get that squirrel! Get that squirrel! We're going to be watching over the next three months as far as how much mobility she has in her joints, how much strength, and how much reduction in pain. Every day, I see something different that she's doing. She's getting a little bit more speed in her step, and she just has a happy look on her face. When she walks, she looks like she is smiling. Come on. Come on. Come on. I'm ecstatic. We have our old dog back. <laughs> I had to give it to her. Dasha, look at that squirrel. <gasps> look. Where's that squirrel? Get that squirrel. You get that squirrel?